Hey guys, it's Linda McGrath Cruz from Perfectly Paralegal with another mini LinkedIn tutorial for you. This is a question that I get frequently and I find that most people um, don't even know that this is an option and it's pretty cool. You can actually set a custom URL um, or a custom website address for your LinkedIn profile. So I want to use uh, my friend Lisa here as um, an example and after I put this video up, I'm going to let her know that I want her to go straight over here and fix this. So if you take a look uh, down here in the contact information section, this is the website address for Lisa's profile. So if Lisa wanted to give out the direct link to her LinkedIn profile, this is the address that she would have to give. And you'll see it has linkedin.com, it has her name, and then it has a bunch of random letters and numbers. Now, LinkedIn actually lets you customize this to pretty much anything you want as long as the name is not already taken. So you can put your name or you can put a nickname. Uh, so let me show you as another example, Michelle Ridge's profile and Michelle has already set a custom URL. So you'll see uh, down here that she doesn't have all those letters and numbers. She just has MD Ridge. And uh, so of course that stands for Michelle Dynamite Ridge because we know that she's dynamite and she's totally awesome. So that's a custom address that she's create, created. So now if Michelle wanted to put this on a business card or in her email footer or just give it to someone, it's obviously a little bit kind of neater. And she can always just tell people, oh, I'm on LinkedIn. My name on LinkedIn is MD Rich, right? And then people would know that they just go to linkedin.com backslash in, which is for LinkedIn, and then backslash MD Ridge, and they'll get her profile. So they don't have to worry about all those other letters and numbers and everything at the end. It's just much neater. So the way that you set that, it's very simple. You're just going to go to your profile. So you're going to click profile on the taskbar. When you go to your profile, you so this is my profile, and you can see mine is LMCFRP, which is what I use for everything. So I try to keep it really uniform. Now, depending on which version of LinkedIn you have at the moment, because they're ruling out changes, you can see that my profile is already ready to be edited because it has the little pencil right next to the, you know, next to the box. Um, if that doesn't come up automatically, you basically just want to edit your profile. So you would go to profile and then edit profile. Then what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down. You're going to look for the address. Now, if the address is not shown here, you can click on contact info and then you'll have all your various contact information, including the address. So all you're going to do is click the little pencil next to the address to edit it. And then you're going to look here, your public profile URL. Enhance your personal brand by creating a custom URL for your LinkedIn public profile. So you're going to click the little pencil again, and then you're going to be able to edit just the last part. So you can put anything. You could put litigation paralegal. You could put paralegal superstar. You could put whatever you want. You could put your initials. You can put your first and last name. You can have a hyphen in there. Um, you can't put spaces, you can't put symbols or special characters. Um, you can put hyphens and you can put a couple of other things. So you just put the information in there, hit save. It'll tell you if it's available or if it's been taken, you know, it'll let you know that it's not available and you have to choose something else. So once you come up with something that you're happy with, you just hit save and then now that's your address. So you can give this link out to people. You can use it on business cards. You can use it in your email footer. Um, you can, you know, give it out to people or you can just say, like I can just say, oh, my nickname on LinkedIn is LMC FRP. So they can just find me that way without having to put, you know, a bunch of numbers and letters in there. So I hope this was helpful. If you guys have any questions or there's something in particular that you would like to learn about LinkedIn that I can help you with, you can always find me online at perfectlyparalegal.com or you can email me at lmc at miamifrp.com. Thanks so much.